Kendrick, everybody say, hey, Kendrick. <laughs> Kendrick is 17 years old. <laughs> is it two months now? Maybe? Two months ago, Kendrick wasn't dancing the dance of freedom. Kendrick was in the streets, in gangs, a life of drugs, and a life of the streets. And we went to Louisville, Kentucky, where he lived. His mother dragged him to church. Yeah. Kendrick went to church on the wrong day. <laughs> Jesus Christ grabbed a hold of Kendrick's heart. He's never been the same since. Somebody give God a praise for Kendrick right now. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. My name is Zach Groves. I'm 19 years old. I'm from Hopkinsville, Kentucky. And eight months ago, I was bound in the streets and strung out on crystal meth and cocaine. And I was a wreck. My life was a wreck. But eight months ago, I was locked up in jail, and I got out on a Friday night, and that following Wednesday night, I found myself at a service where Eddie James was, after not going to church for two years, and I found myself at the altar, and 
and I come up to the front and I surrender my life to Jesus Christ and he put his blood over my life and he set me free from all the bitterness and all the pain that I had in my heart the every day, the every day life was gone I laid down my life and I don't know what I would do I was thinking today, I don't know what I would do I don't know what I would do if I wasn't doing this today I would be dead or in jail and it, it's real, the freedom is real My name is Brandon, 24, from Mississippi. I grew up in a divorced home. Uh, I was in rejection my whole life, mostly due to the absence of an emotional relationship with my father. Uh, I was taught to suppress issues in my life by the church, which were issues such as being bound by a lie that I was born a homosexual. But uh, in October, which is almost six months ago, last year, man, at Eddie's service, I just, I gave it to him. I gave it to him. I gave it all to him. And today, I got a revelation today that his body was broken for me and his blood was poured for me. That's all I realized today. I was like, man, today, today is still the day that his body can still be broken for somebody. It can still be freedom for somebody. Still be freedom for you, man.